New this half hour, the Mobile City Council now has the results of a disparity study that examined how many minority owned businesses get contracts in the city. Local 15's Christian Jennings, you have the results of that study and what this means for the city of Mobile. Hey, Callie, good afternoon. That's right. Actually, a city official just emailed a copy of that disparity study to my phone a couple of minutes ago. So I'm in the process of looking it all over and breaking it down for you. But just to sum it up, an outside company looked at the way the city did business between 2010 and 2012 and basically found that minority and women owned businesses in Mobile were significantly underutilized. So they did find a disparity. And city officials say they plan to change that. One of the best and easiest ways they feel they can better utilize minority services is to educate business owners on how to get involved in the city's process of rewarding contracts. Now also in this study, um, in this study are recommendations by this outside company on how the city can alleviate this problem and I will break all that down for you in my story beginning at 5 o'clock. Reporting live outside Government Plaza, I'm Christian Jennings, Local 15 News.